helping you plan your day. WOWT6 is the weather authority. Good morning, everyone. Today we're starting off in the 40s and still going to be above average as far as the high temperatures go. We should be in the lower 50s in a typical day like today, and we'll climb above that no problem. Some clouds around, though, going to keep it a little cooler than yesterday. So here's some of those clouds as we make our way towards noon. We're in the mid 50s. Then by the afternoon, I think we top out about 58, 59 degrees in the metro. There could be a few isolated 60s in, in Sarpy County and then further south. So something we'll have to watch. But still, you're not going to notice much difference driving around the area today. Upper 50s or lower 60s. That's where you make it. And then the clouds try to thin out a little bit, but I think they're going to be kind of stubborn tonight. By 4 o'clock, we're still at 59. Still some of those clouds this evening. And down to 52 by 7. We'll bottom out at about 50. Then Veterans Day, unfortunately, that's the worst weather day of the week. Very strong area of low pressure moving through the area. Gives us scattered showers through the morning hours. And then afternoon, watch what tries to develop. We're close enough to this area of low pressure that on the southern edge of it, we may catch a few isolated thunderstorms that strengthen too. Enough spin in the atmosphere. And some of these could become severe and they'll race off to the east very quickly. So by about 3 o'clock, the threat for storms over. Still some rain possible, but very, very windy after 3 o'clock. We're talking strong northwest winds. The gust may be up to 55, 60 miles per hour, and that continues into Thursday.